I have the pleasure to be with Musopa from Zambia, who's the winner of the Block for Death competition, who addresses solutions for the future of jobs in Africa and the digital economy. So, uh, Musopa, can you introduce yourself and tell us more about your blog? Okay, so my name is Musopa Kalenga and I'm from Zambia. My blog focused on uh, investing in human capital um, as a means to preparing young people for the future of work and the digital economy. So um, I was asking the, the Zambian government to invest in education and also to invest in the health sector. So with education, um, education should aim at empowering young people with skills such as cognitive, uh, social behavioral and uh, adaptability skills. Because I believe that these skills are, will be relevant for the future of work and the digital economy. And then I also believe that um, for a country for a country to succeed, it, it, it must have like a healthy population. Mm -hmm. Therefore, the government should also invest in the health sector by introducing digital technologies. And from here, the World Bank have just learned that um, a country like Rwanda is actually using digital technologies, using drones to actually deliver blood and other health services and products in rural areas. So that um, that is uh, my blog, uh, basically, in a nutshell. Okay, great. So you've been in DC for couple of days now mm -hmm. you've attended a million different meetings mm -hmm. a million different events you actually visited DC and I hope went shopping so I want to tell I want you to tell us how has been your experience so far and what was the most memorable um, thing that happened Wow um, so it was my first time being in DC and being in the US so it was um, a big deal <laughs> to be here and um, one thing um, that I've learned so much or that has really inspired me is how the World Bank and other and other leaders have really embraced young people and um, today I attended the my human capital event and was so inspiring to see all these leaders just committing to uh, empowering young people so for me that has been a very, um, my highlight and also um, visiting the museum and experiencing the Berlin Wall which I learned about it well I learned about the Berlin Wall uh, in history for a very long time so it was actually amazing to have to experience the Berlin Wall, even though it was segments of the war, but it was still um, a memorable experience. Great, I'm happy you liked it. So, one last question will be, you talk about the future of jobs, you talk about the future of Africa, and the digital economy and all this. So my question is, what is your dream job? Um, wow. <laughs> so um, my dream job is actually to be in a position where I'd be able to influence policy making. Mm -hmm because I've realized that it is very important for any country. And um, I'd like to be in a position where I can influence policies on education and health, um, well, in general, human development. So if I can be in such a job, that would be my dream job. That's great. And I think we need more policymakers and we need more young people to be part of that. And so I hope one day you may be the minister of something mm -hmm. in Zambia. <laughs> So hopefully it's either education or health. I'm counting on you and I'm happy you were here. And thank you everyone for watching us and uh, feel free to participate next year. Thank you. Thank you.